Pipe TV people! As you can see here, that's probably quite a good thing. So what we do when we're using a, a damp course, this is what we use. And now we, there are other products in the market and I'm not saying this is the best. I'm saying this is just what we use. So we use dry rods. Uh, you can look it up on the internet. It's a very, very simple thing to do. Let's see if I can pull one out, shall I? So let's pull this one out. Ah, there we go. So, the principle of this is we drill a hole on, on every perp. We would drill there because there's a perp going down. We would drill there because there's a perp going up. We would drill there, there's a perp going down. So it's roughly every half a brick. We drill a hole and literally just get one of these, these rods and stick it in the hole and leave it. And what this does is inside there, the chemicals, uh, there's enough chemicals in there, it's guaranteed by the manufacturer, to then reach, then reach the next perb. So this is probably an easier way to show it because it's started to activate. So on this specific wall, you can see where we've put the rod and how it's getting wet. And what it happens is, is that that then spreads and eventually they will touch over time. And then that we know that all the cement that's in that bed there is, is, is saturated with the stuff inside there, which stops the, which stops the water coming up through the floor and into there. So that's quite a good diagram there of how it works. So you can see how this one spread more. Eventually these will do the same. And that, then we know that all that cement bed is completely and utterly covered. And I'm looking for where I pull this out so I can put it back in. Voila. Oh, I love that. Look at that action. And the reason that I like to use these is because if I aren't doing it myself, you can get stuff in a cream, but what you have to do is only, you, you only drill through three quarters of the brick. So the idea is that the back part of the cement is still left in. And then you just squirt the cream in and that's okay. However, if you drill too far and the cement comes off the other side and you're squirting your cream, your cream will just go through the hole straight through to the other side and you've wasted a load of product. Whereas this, you can't waste any, so it's it's more of a guarantee. So for my peace of mind, I know that if we use this product, there's enough in there to get to the other side. And even if it does blow the back out because it's been drilled too far, it doesn't matter because it's not a cream. It's a solid, it's a solid stick. And the other good thing is when I walk around and do an inspection like this, I know it's been done because I can see the little white tips. So I know it's done right. And that's what it's all about.